There are amazing little wetlands scattered throughout the state that people have no idea are even present. And that's exactly where they thrive. On the western side of the Central Valley in these small wetland jungles, you will find the epicenter of California's nutria problem. This is where we've taken more nutria than in any other county in California. And you quickly realize what a challenge nutria eradication will be. Um, there's nothing quick about uh, eradicating nutria, looking for nutria, nothing easy about it. Um, and you see that firsthand when you're sloshing through the marsh, uh, checking traps. Uh, last year we pulled almost 90 nutria out of this wetland here. We got a detection recently where a nutria had returned to this area, and so that's why we have returned with traps and we're trying to remove all the remaining nutria. The traps often catch the area's native inhabitants like this muskrat, they get set free. As for the nutria, they aren't just hard to find. Their ability to reproduce makes them very hard to get rid of. 13 months, they could, uh, the one pair could result in up to 200 individuals. We have nothing here in California to limit their numbers in any fashion. So California is mobilizing to stop the spread on its own with a nearly $10 million effort that now stretches from Merced County to Stockton. The yellows are where we have had or currently have cameras placed, and the pink dots are where we have current detections. And while the nutria pose a huge threat to the Central Valley's agriculture and its wildlife habitat like this marsh, the real damage would come if they could spread in large numbers north of Interstate 580. Our goal is to keep them out of the delta. Compromising those levees, um, compromising our cities behind those levees, compromising the state's ability to move um, water around for agriculture, for drinking water in Southern California. Uh, how confident are you that you can stop them? Well, there's only one chance we're going to get. Um, if we wait too long, then our chance will disappear and we'll have to live with them forever. So what's with all the sweet potatoes? Well, this is kind of the sweet potato capital of the valley. There are plenty of them laying around. Farmers have actually donated them to the cause. Now, can you shoot these things? Yes, you can, but they are nocturnal and they are burrowing. So let me tell you, they are kind of hard to find and California is going to be looking for them for a long time to come. In San Joaquin County, Wilson Walker, KPIX 5.